have a what you got? I'm mm, I'm trying to tear this paper in a straight line. Oh, but I am not. Look at that. I like it's like I've got peaks and valleys. Like this is not a straight line. Not a straight line. And you, I know it can be done. I just don't know why it's not working. So wait, let me check something. Okay. This is um, like newsprint. Like, yeah, this is like papers? a newsprint. Like, okay. Um, so I think what you're doing is you're tearing the wrong direction. You're tearing across the polymers instead of with the polymers. Okay, no, you're gonna have to explain that. All right, so you're tearing it that way. I'm tearing it, yeah. Like I'm going way. to take it and tear it from this edge instead of the side. Okay. All right, so. Whoa, <laughs> that is completely different. Here, you try it. Uh, okay. So now we have some nice strips of straight paper. Straight paper. That is exactly what I need to do. No scissors required. So, okay. Why does that work? Well, paper is made out of fibers. Okay. Plant. Yeah, yeah. Because it's a plant material. Like yeah, plant wood. fibers. Yeah. yeah. So those plant fibers during the process are are made so that they're all going the same direction. Okay. Right, so, so when this is made in a factory, all the fibers are going the same direction. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you. You tear it that way, you're tearing along those fibers or okay. those polymers. That makes total if sense. If we're tearing this way, you're tearing again. Oh, yes, perpendicular to it, to use some math words. Awesome. Yeah. So, so okay, I, I understand what you're saying. I would like a little bit more background on the word polymer. So poly means many, many right. and polymer means a chain of many. Okay. So what we could do is use some paper clips. So this is a monomer. Because it's one. One. Got Mono it. means one. Yep. And then you can hook another one together. And this is a polymer. You could call it a duomer if you wanted to, but <laughs> polymer is fine. And let's keep, let's do at least four of them. Okay. Because that's definitely going to be a polymer. That's definitely a polymer. Yeah. So those polymers are all linked together. But they can still move, just like our paper. See how our paper moves? Yeah. Yeah, I see and that. those can move too. So polymers are long chains of, of uh, different molecules that we can use to make things like paper and plastic and, well, there's lots of other things. So, All right. And it's really cool when you do this. I'm going to give you this. This is a, well, that. Uh, like, um, this is like a the gift basket. Uh, yes. Yeah, you straw. put this to make gift baskets. Yeah. Pretty. So what I want you to do is I want you to tear or pull slowly, try it. Pull this apart And slowly. pull it really slowly apart. You're gonna be sliding those polymers across the chair. Oh, that's super cool. Oh, you can actually goodness. see where the edge is. Yeah, it's, it's clear. It's, yeah, well, we're, we're pulling the material for those, those polymers further apart. Here, I'll let you make another one of these. That's very cool. Make another All right, so I'll make another polymer, polymer chain, but that's awesome. I definitely awesome? wanna get a close up of that. Yeah. All right, so now I'm going to make my own polymer chain. Right. Okay. I can do that very quickly. So I have this. You have your chain. Now, these are the same polymers, even though we're using different colors. Yeah. All right, so I've these just... are the same polymers, but we have different colors. It's a lot easier to see if you have contrasting colors. That working. totally yes. makes sense. Yeah, I'm down with that. This is what we're doing. So they're all aligned. Okay. And then as we're, you're pulling that plastic, we're sliding oh, them a little further apart. So they're moving. But, and they're like, they're like kind of like sliding past each other. Sliding past each other. That's very mm -hmm. cool. So chains of polymers. Right. Yeah. So you can see if you tear the wrong way, I'm going to give you part of my plastic bag. Just see how okay. easily I, I tore yeah, that plastic bag? Totally. Tore so what we're going to do is, this is one of those little shopping bags that you should put in the recycling bin when you're done. Yes. Like at the front of the stores. Yes. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and pull it apart this way. Just like that Easter grass. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's very now, easy to do. Yeah, so you can like stick a lot of groceries in there. Yeah. But they eventually break. But they eventually break. Now, just look how easy it is to pull that way. 
Oh wow! Yeah, it's just they are totally tearing. different. But even these, you can see when you can you can pull them apart. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, eventually, the force overtakes it. Yeah, humans use polymers all the time. But there's, there's so this is like a garbage bag, like when they talk about those flex bags. Exactly. Yes. So cheaper bags, fewer polymers, more expensive bags, more polymers. More polymers. Yeah. There's actually a lot more that we can do with polymers and chemistry. I so want to do a lot more with. Let's polymers. go get some more stuff. Yes.